Hi everyone! Okay, today, very specific, I've got somebody who's going to be reaching out to someone watching this today, okay? They're going to reach out during the winter months, I feel, December, January, February. You have been in no contact or in separation for a while, over a year, all right? I feel this person is older than you. Um, their personality, they're quite a real, they're quite a protective person, quite conservative. They take their time, okay? They're not the sort of person that makes decisions in a hurry, all right? They are going to reach out with you, reach out to you. I'm getting a email, all right? Not just a short message. This is kind of quite a long, a long email. And I feel what is going to be in this email is going to be how they want to find a solution to this now, okay? They've got a plan, all right? They've definitely, definitely got a plan. So I'm gonna go into that a little bit deeper. Like I said, it's going to be uh, December, January, February. I feel it's a winter thing. Um, the flame for you has never gone out, even though it has been a, a long time, this one, but the flame has never, ever gone out. All right, so I'm going to go deeper, like I said, and see what else is going on. Just while I'm shuffling, though, if you would like a personal reading, just click on the title of this video. If you're on a mobile, it's all in the description box, link to the website, everything's on there. And also check out the free relationship report as well. And thank you so much for watching, liking, commenting, all your support it is so so lovely um i can't thank you enough and if you want to see any more of this content and you haven't already done so if you just hit the bell to subscribe okay clear as day today different deck they're going to come forward they're going to want marriage or if you've divorced or whatever they want to recommit okay with the courtship card all right so yeah, they are going to come forward. Um, with that card, I would say that they are possibly leaving a situation behind, okay, that involves other people, not necessarily third party. Um, what are their regrets? I've just heard that, what are their regrets? What are their regrets, please? Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. They regret getting caught up in another situation. Okay. They could have followed the money. Simply just followed the money. But I feel what they regret is giving up the stability and the security that they had with you. You and this person had at some point in your connection a golden opportunity almost like a gift from the gods as we say could have been an inheritance it could have been some money that you came across something happened that gave you an opportunity to do something really good okay you were the one that put the work in you were the one that kept the home fires burning okay the biggest regret i'm hearing is your person regrets not committing to your connection fully and not taking this opportunity that you had as a couple, okay? They also regret doing the talk but not actually putting the action is in. But it's quite a sad energy that, that there was something golden here something absolutely golden here if you divorced or you had a contract you know like an engagement or something like that or even if you just signed a contract on somewhere to live there is some contract that was broken that they really 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 regret okay they really regret this I feel the energy they are bringing in now is of someone who is wiser, more mature, 
they just know they've calmed down that like i said earlier they are quite conservative in some ways and they do take their time but there is a side to them that will just bounce to something else they regret bouncing all right they definitely definitely regret bouncing um you would definitely possibly or definitely i feel actually the one that was better with the money here um i could be reading for someone today who is an earth sign okay so you could be capricorn virgo taurus or have a lot of that in your chart but if you're none of those if you're not an actual earth sign per se i feel that there is, there are earth planets in the house that represents your finances you're grounded you always opened your door you always helped people and I don't just mean a shoulder to cry on. You actually physically helped people. Okay? You physically helped people. So let me see what is going on with them. Let's have a little peek now. So give you a bit of a heads up. Right. Okay. The party's over. Group of friends that they've connected into. Or group of people where it all seemed quite exciting and fresh and new possibly an overindulgence in something maybe alcohol but that's over now yeah they have connected in or they've been connected into somebody where uh, two's company and three's a crowd so they have recently found out that there is somebody amongst their group that is quite deceitful somebody who comes across as very charming very capable a lot of abilities but it's actually all fake okay i think this is what has really triggered them deep down you you were willing to get your hands dirty okay as the saying goes you were willing to do the work you know i just see somebody digging digging a garden i don't know why but you were willing to to get the work done okay now this other set of people or possibly just one person that they've been fraternizing with has turned out to be fake they fell for this offer whatever this offer was because the person or persons were very good at being something they are not they could talk the talk but not walk the walk you walked the walk and going back to what i heard right back at the beginning was your person regrets talking the talk but not doing it with this opportunity that you had you know in a nutshell they just thought everybody was going to be like you I see that so so often where Maybe people do, maybe we all have a tendency at times to do that. We don't always know what we've got until it's gone or until we try something else and then we realise, hell no. So yeah, there is a lot of deceit and dishonesty um, within their environment at the moment, okay? What should have been successful hasn't really been working out. Um, this one member of something that they're connected into, it could be a social group that they're connected into, who always likes to take centre stage. They're having problems with this person, okay? That person could be a Leo. Anything else that we need to know about this other person's environment and the change of heart, please? Yeah, they've... they've they're in the two of wands energy. Um, you know, it's just not working out. The, it seemed very exciting, very new, very all of that kind of stuff to start with. But now they've realised there's a bigger world out there and they want you in that world. They want you back, okay? Um, they've got one foot in the door 
on one foot out of the door at the moment. This is why I feel, you know, now this card's come out, it really makes sense about right back at the beginning where I'm feeling it's, it's the winter. So their energy at the moment is they are not doing anything. They're not taking any action, okay? There's no action. They're not going from here to there. But what they are doing is re-evaluating their options. So although you think there is no movement... And because it has been such a long time, this will be a bit of a shock, I feel. But behind the scenes, and there's always movement behind the scenes. Always, always. If you look back over your life, you'll always look at something and think, gosh, that was happening and I didn't even know. What is going on behind the scenes now is your person is disgruntled. They're not happy where they are. Um, it's not really rocking their boat. Their social life isn't as good as they thought it was going to be or it, it's just run its course it's run its course and the reason is when this card always when this card comes out in something like this it's always a case of somebody wanting to go back to their long-term partner or their spouse they've divorced or a long-term relationship it's like they got to a certain point off they went you know, midlife crisis, not really into labels, but to give you an example, an allergy of the energy, like a midlife crisis. And then once they burnt it out of their system, plus the fact that there is two's company, three is a crowd, um, there is someone they're connected into is, is hiding their true, or has been hiding, their true personality. This is a culmination is causing your person now to look at ways of coming back to you. Now, this person won't come back in without a plan. Okay, they're not just going, although when they contact you, it's going to be a shock. Behind that shock is an actual concrete plan that they are going to bring towards you. Okay, they are not going to just contact you and say hey and contained within this email I feel it's an email are going to be suggestions on how you could take this connection further so let me see what they would say to you now if they were in the room with you you're probably telepathically communicating with this person what would they say now, please? You were the best thing in my life. Yeah. You were the best thing in their life. You were the Queen of Pentacles. I wish I had treated you better. I couldn't let you get close to me. Yeah, they pushed you away. I feel this isn't a, you know, some those of you watch me regularly, some of the energy really is quite toxic, narcissistic in, you know, gaslighting. I just feel this person made a mistake. Okay. Again, midlife crisis. Maybe they wanted to be with a group of people they, they, I feel they were starting to feel their age a bit, okay? So I've got the lilies here. I feel they were starting to feel that age a bit. Maybe they'd had um, an illness that they recovered from or there was, some, there was some illness or maybe somebody they were connected into that they suddenly started to think that they hadn't lived their life, all right? But the part is over. That it was only ever going to be a short-term energy. You know when, when you it's sort of that energy of, of when you're younger and you you know you're quite happy to party till like four four or five in the morning, and then it seems really exciting. But I feel they did that later on in life. They've done something later on in life, sort of forties onwards. Maybe they didn't do it as a child, or maybe when they were younger they didn't do it. And, and, and almost, I, I feel that their decision to end your connection was 
quite shocking, not just to you, but to a, quite a few other people as well, because they had always come across as quite conservative, quite, I'm not saying slow, I said they were slow, but they didn't, they didn't have that many sort of really mad impulsive tendencies. Okay, they didn't really have that many mad impulsive tendencies going down here. Mm. So, why do they wish that they had treated whoever this is for today better? Why do they wish they treated somebody better, please? Three of Swords. Yeah, pretty straightforward. They broke your heart. They regret breaking your heart. They regret leaving you lonely. They regret betraying you. If there was third parties, they regret that. They regret letting you down and disappointing you. You know, but more than that, they should have talked to you. There was always a bit towards the end, at some point, an elephant in the room um, that you, you skirted round. You picked up on it. You sensed it. But they brushed it under the carpet and just kept saying, no, no, don't want to talk about it. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. And then they just went. They just went. OK. There was definitely something to do here with ill health, but they just regret all of that. They regret it. They regret breaking your heart. They regret the upheaval they've caused, the grief and the sorrow. Can you give me one, please, on this one person who's in their environment, please? Air energy, Gemini, Libra or Aquarius. Yeah, there's somebody that is, yeah, it's lack of discipline. That's what it boils down to, it's lack of discipline. They got into a situation, okay, I feel today, where, like I said, it looked like fun, party, 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 whatever that means, you know, like let off the leash, off the reins, later on in life. But now, because of your relationship, that's burnt out. And one of the core problems is that they're connected into a person or a group of people who have a lack of discipline. Now, for your person, this is a really important message. That is what they were attracted to because throughout their life, they hadn't been like that. It goes back to they are quite slow moving. They're quite conservative. Whatever came over them, triggered, I feel, by some health crisis with somebody they went for that situation but now there is just the just like a lack of discipline and lies and just um a lack of control because what i'm getting with your person is they they do like a plan that's what they're coming in with that was the card that came out you know they're coming in with a plan not a half cocked idea and whilst this was fun, you know, whilst this was fun, going back to when, you know, when you when you sort of a lot younger and, you know, maybe all weekenders and things, it's almost like they went on one of those because they hadn't done it before, okay? But they caused havoc when they did it. I'm hearing they're coming to the senses. It was a blip. This was a blip. There's no malice here. So this is not toxic. This is someone genuinely going through the journey of their life and messing up. All right. And messing up. They almost wanted to shed their seriousness at some level. Right. Okay, let's see what else they would like to say, please. But they will be back in. The outcome's there. They will come back in. Like I said, it'll be in the winter. What else would they like to say, please? Damage. Yeah. 
you know, they got caught up in the moment. It's almost like they got, got swept away, swept away in the excitement, like they were a leaf, okay? And you're the tree, I just heard, but they got swept away in the excitement. It was like it was all whirling and I can see dancing. I'm really getting those vibes, but that's what they want to say. By lying, I ripped us apart, their dishonesty. You know what I feel they really feel today? It's, they did tell lies like verb. Yeah, they did, they did tell lies like coming out of their mouths, like you can hear me talking now. But what I feel today they really regret is what they didn't say. The elephant in the room. They regret not putting the effort in, not livening things up a bit. And instead of working with you, because all relationships after a period of time, you know, they, they do, not, not always stagnant, but you know, they're never as exciting as that first flame. But you felt the flame going out, okay, and they didn't tell you the truth. That's what they regret. They just denied it, you know, went into their little den or their little cave or wherever they went. You know, maybe they, I, I just see them engrossed in a hobby before you separated. They didn't tell you the truth. That's what they regret. They really do regret that. So let me get you a card. Let's get you a card. Um, but yeah, winter time. Winter time. One card, please. Yeah, that is it. You have a deep knowing about this person. That's what the card is, deep knowing. You know at an intuitive level that you are right about this person. You've known this. You know it's not over. You know it's not over. Um, you're connected to this person at a very, very deep level. You are very wise, you have a lot of wisdom. I feel I'm reading for people today, if this is your reading, who who have an old soul. You know, many, many reincarnations. Okay, many, many reincarnations. It's almost as if you've sat back now and you're getting on with your life, but you kind of just, you just know, you know, okay? So yeah, that is a clarification for you. All right, this person will be back yeah they are going to reach out um they're bringing a new maturity in though okay bringing a very very high level of maturity into this connection i think you're going to be quite surprised actually so i will leave that with you lovely reading today for somebody just remember you are the open power you could have been manifesting this person back in and that's where the knowing comes from even if you see no movement and nobody's speaking to anybody and the circumstances look dire once you get to a point of just knowing that's when it switches up. So take care. Love you all. Speak soon. Bye.